Hello everyone. Talk to my parents. They're alive. They're okay, but they're not sleeping because the sirens have been going off basically every two to three hours. So nobody is getting any rest. And remember what I told you about the different sets of um, alarms there and some of it is nationwide or, or regional. Yeah, between th those two, there is just no rest for anybody. Zaporizhia's Neighbor to the north, Dnipro, has been attacked again. Uh, what happened there was a missile fell smack dab between two apartment buildings, clipped one side of one, the other side of the other. There are uh, wounded and um, a two-year-old child is among the casualties. What did I tell you about Bakhmut? After struggling for it for almost a year, Russians still don't have a firm hold on it. Ukrainian troops are dug in and just continue chipping away and chipping away and chipping away, causing Russians to waste more of their people and very expensive ammunition. There's a pretty good article on BBC about Russians leaving Russia. Some of it started quite some time ago, back in 2014, when Crimea was annexed. What we need from people leaving Russia, because they can't live in that regime anymore, is to speak up. When those of us from originally from Ukraine talk about the war in Ukraine, we're accused of being biased, which we are, we get it. But we need you guys to speak up and tell the world what is actually happening in Russia and show the world that not all of you are completely brainwashed. Things are heating up in uh, towns and villages along the Russian-Ukrainian border, such as Belgorod and Shebekino. Considering how many people from those areas celebrated whenever Russian missiles hit Ukrainian hospitals and killed Ukrainian women and babies, I'm surprised they're so unhappy that the war has been delivered to their homes. What's the problem, people? Special operation is going according to plan. And now I want to say a few words to my Ukrainian compatriots who seem to not quite understand the purpose of this channel. The breathing. Якщо у вас є якесь нове джерело новин та інформації, прокоментуйте, будь ласка. Я піду шукаю. Якщо у вас є поправка до попереднього репортажу, прокоментуйте, будь ласка. Я піду перевірю, шукаю інформацію. Але якщо ви тільки хочете кричати та канючити щодо моєї вимови, цей канал не про вас. Підіть, шукайте собі якусь цікаву, корисну справу. Дякую. Thank you for watching.